I think it's going to be, oh, damn, I didn't even get a chance to vote. That would have been my vote though. This one. I don't have my keys. I'm gonna find them, hopefully, any day my door. I'm gonna have to look stupid. The door wasn't locked, mate. <laughs> March 20th to really soak in space with lots of gratitude for the thing that it taught me as I go into my transition into my next space. I'm staying at the same unit, but I'm gonna be moving. Or I'm staying at the same like community, but just a different unit. But I will no longer have this view of the entire skyline and of the construction. But I honestly, like, I've enjoyed watching it. And it's always just been a reflective thing for me of, like, my whole spirit team just mm, mm, putting in work. Friends are over me. And I love that. I'm excited. My new view is going to be part of the city. So this part over there which I like because sometimes the moon be over there. Um, and then I'll have like a park that I can look at, look at grass in the water and just, you know, no construction, <laughs> no noise. It's very quiet over there. I'm excited about that. I'm downsizing from this to a studio. So I'm really the next, I think it's like down to 20, Four days, 24 days left here. I'm gonna really just enjoy space, take it up before I move into my transition. The pole class, I didn't even tell y'all. The pole class went great. Um, I really enjoyed it and everybody said that I was able to help them, which makes me really proud. And Everybody really like did they shit. Like people were not afraid to try new things. How rude of me. This is the salad from yesterday. Spinach and then corn. I'll be cooking my corn on a skillet to like fry it. Um salmon chopped up. And then I'm gonna put some fried onions on top. And then there's red peppers and orange peppers. And then there's this lemon butter type of sauce. I'm not a sauce person. I've never ate a salad before because I don't do ranch. Oh, and it's broccoli in there. But this sauce at Flower Child, they be having it on they broccoli. But True Food Kitchen, fuck. True Food Kitchen used it as like a salad dressing. And it's actually so good. But it threw me off at first. I really had to overcome my mental because I'm just like, oh my gosh. It's like you're eating the sauce. I don't like sauce. And this brought me to the realization that I'm scared of sauce. Ketchup, mayonnaise, ranch, none of that. Barbecue and hot sauce only. Sweet and sour at McDonald's only. Like I really sent my mama a picture of like I'm eating salad. Like it's that deep. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> That's the 
this time, I really could eat this shit dry, like no sauce. If I'm being honest. But I'm gonna do a, a little bit. I'm gonna warm her up for like 30 seconds. I'm the type of bitch. I don't like microwave my food. Like, it don't need to be hot. <laughs> it needs to be lukewarm. But it's already 10 seconds on the screen. I'm gonna to to see what that hit. I think I'm going to pack the rest of that salad. Take it to India. She's at work. A tad bit longer. Because the sauce comes slow. Not too much. It's not a little one available. Not to finish out. I need to do dishes, bitch. Mind your motherfucking business. All right? Because I do my dishes. I was supposed to this morning, but I kind of, I was about to tell a whole lot. I was about to say I had a late start of my day, but I didn't. I woke up early as fuck. They had breakfast in bed. You know? Then after that, I went live and got ready. By the time we had got up though to get ready, it was really time to go. So, went straight to class. I'm gonna give her a fork. I'm gonna take her a black fork. My kids need some summer. Hold up. Meet Piper, the land bitch. Meet Star, enjoy. Meet 
Like, I really believe that it's the soil, but these bottom ones have been drooped before a while. And it's starting to turn yellow and some brown. That's why I feel like it's just the soil and her needing a better soil to actually soak up the water when I water it. I don't know what's happening. Joy really got fucked up from the tap water. I 
like curlies are just about ready to fall off. No to cut at the node so they can grow. And Zena taught me to peel off like the dead stuff around it to open up the hormones and encourage some growth. I really need to buy more clothes because I don't even need to buy more clothes. I need people to send me clothes. Michaela wants fashion sponsorships, fashion collaborations. That's what I want, and it wants me back. Fuck. I'm wearing my girlfriend's clothes today because she got these white pants from Urban. They need to be ironed. Ugh. And it's okay. It's not even gonna take me that long. It's no need to complain about it. Let me just get the iron and make it fucking happen. <laughs> Breathe, smile, and accept. It's the lesson of the fucking day. Perfume of the day is this one. I showed her this on my live. I really like it. I need to go re up on my alien goddess. These are bands. Go. My friend has a lip liner. If you guys would like to purchase, this is what I'm gonna put on. I just had my other one from the beauty supply store, but it's darker. I like this one, it's a lot more natural. From 222 Pretty Lash Co. Saying I'm out of storage, so I don't play with me, please. It says that I'm gonna get there at 444. <laughs> Need I say more? I tried to call them just to check first because like I really hate wasting my time. <laughs> but I'm not wasting my time. I'm going for the experience. I want to experience it, so going for the experience with no expectations no attachments to the outcome i don't be making this shit up see i should have listened to myself but this is what it's look, looking like it's real cute that's the girl on the front but they're closed today only for fucking construction and they open tomorrow so i just did all of that for fucking what for fucking what? <laughs> for fucking what? I need to have better judgment on things. Because I could have judged, oh, they didn't answer as, okay, don't go. But I judged it as, oh, just pull up and see. Well, I know the answer was very clear. That sucks, though. But I'm glad I got to see it, got to see what area it's in. That's always nice. That's always nice. And I guess now I can figure out what I want to eat in this area. I should actually back up and figure that out before I pull off, figure out where the hell I'm going. Ooh, there's an antique store right there. We going over there. <laughs> so I can look and see what they got because I didn't get to like do up 
my loft how I envisioned. But when I relocate, I plan to. Um, for sure. Ooh, this is a big ass one. Yes. Okay, we're about to go in here and just enjoy my own company. See ya. About to go into antique shop. I'm so excited. Antique stores remind me of my grandmama. Like, my granny loved going to the antique store. And I used to be ungrateful not wanting to go with her because we'd be in there all day. But look at me. Faye will be proud. Thank <laughs> you. 